do a flip. <laughs> All right, puny human. Oh, damn, I didn't think he'd actually do it. Ladies, gentlemen, and hunters of all ages, we got a brand new Wild Hearts trailer at the Game Awards, and oh boy, is it a good one. Not to spoil what we've got coming out in the rest of this video, but we got two new kimono, a new confirmed name for a kimono that we already knew about, and we got a sneak peek at a weapon that hadn't been shown before, which is quite clearly the great sword equivalent of this game. So that said, let's break down this brand new entire minute of a trailer that we've been given with as much detail as possible about new things to look at and pay attention to. First up, we see Deathstalker, the ice wolf who has been in trailer before. This one is a pretty gigantic creature, similar to the massiveness of King Tusk, and we see him acrobatically jumping off of the walls that it's creating itself in real time. If you actually slow the footage down, you will see the wall come into an existence as the monster is already in the air, just looking like an absolute badass. On the note of badassery, though, here we see the reveal of a new weapon, a gigantic sword, a great sword. In this short clip here, it does what is clearly a draw attack from a sheathed position on the back, and Josh is just jumping up and down right now, he's waking up from his sleep at the sheer mention of the word greatsword from my mouth, and of course for anyone who enjoys that archetype of weapon in hunting style games, this is a big moment for you. After that we see a staff weapon, we have seen this in brief gameplay before, these are dual blades that you can also stick together at the hilts to make a dual bladed polearm, but the first time that we saw it, it was only in the staff mode while it was sheathed that turned into the dual blades when it was taken out, whereas here it appears to be unsheathed still in one big piece which tells us a little bit more about the weapon, as it may well have two totally separate combat forms that you can swap between at will for a different moveset. After that, we get a brand new kimono reveal. We have seen the silhouette of this one for a quarter of a second in a previous trailer, but now we have the full reveal, a name, a Matarasu, and we see a small bit of its moveset, which includes a massive heavenly beam. All we've seen from it so far is that it loves these big golden beams, we see a couple different ones of them, and then it looks absolutely sick, flying above you through the sky like a gigantic phoenix. It's gorgeous and I cannot wait to see more of it in future trailers and of course within the game itself. Then finally, one more new kimono referred simply to as the Golden Tempest. And this thing just looks awesome. It's like a saber toothed tiger with tentacles that it uses for acrobatics. It starts out with a sick flip and then it doesn't get to do much as far as actual fighting. Though right before the end of this trailer, we see it jump into the fucking stratosphere like a multi-phased rocket launch. I get the feeling that each of these three kimono that they've been showing in this trailer are just a really big deal within the game. They are definitely later game creatures, and they'll probably have quite a bit of story importance too. As well, back on the note of the great sword that we saw, we also see its jump attack off of the box, which looks like a really cool downward plunge, and then another really interesting thing that I noticed, at this point in the trailer, the great sword is once again sheathed, but in a different position, held at the side rather than on the back, and that makes me think this will be an actual part of the great sword's moveset, which is quite exciting to see as a way of shaking things up. And that's just about it, everyone. We got to see two brand new kimono, we got a name for one that we had already seen before, and we got a limited amount of footage of a big ass sword that will absolutely excite anyone who likes big slow weapon gameplay in hunting games. I hope you've enjoyed this breakdown, and I cannot wait for even more information to come on this game. I'm actually getting pretty excited about it. Like if you liked the video, subscribe to the notification bell for more, and most importantly, ladies and gentlemen, until next time, stay sweet. Josh, Cotton, and Hollow with the videos Dropping the humor like a hammer on your tippy toes Bringing entertainment on a daily arrangement To take our insanity and turn it into entertainment Yes, I said entertainment twice To reiterate that it is nice To look into your faces on a mostly daily basis When you let us in your homes to make the whole world a stage Is, uh, goodbye